Malaria is a major public health problem in countries with endemic disease. Infection during pregnancy may increase the risk of fetal loss and maternal death. In appropriate regions, one of the WHO recommended treatments for women in their second or third trimester of pregnancy is a three day course of artemisinin based combination therapy. But data on the efficacy and safety of artemisinin based therapy in pregnant women are limited. In this study, 3,428 women from four sub Saharan African countries who were infected with falciparum malaria and in their second or third trimester of pregnancy were randomized to one of four artemisinin based therapies artemithirlumafantrine, amodiaquine artesanate, mefloquine artesanate, or dihydroartemisinin piperaquine. All of the women received a three day course of therapy, and all study drugs were given under direct observation. The primary outcomes of the study were PCR-based laboratory evidence of cure at day 63 and safety. The PCR cure rate in the group treated with artemether lumefantrine was statistically lower than the rates in the other three groups, but was within a pre-specified margin that was thought not to be clinically relevant. There were no significant differences in PCR cure rates among the other three groups. The overall numbers of serious adverse events and adverse birth outcomes were similar among treatment groups, although some drug side effects such as asthenia, poor appetite, dizziness, nausea, and vomiting occurred more frequently in women treated with mefloquine artesanate or amodiaquine artesanate. Thus the artemisinin-based combination regimens used to treat malaria in pregnant women are efficacious. Dihydroartemisinin piperaquine based therapy appears to have the best efficacy and safety profile. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.